What's up, everybody? So, this is Russ with rwgresearch.com. Um, I'm filthy. I am doing some recycling. Uh, my dad randomly gathers up things like, you know, a couple of 36-volt battery chargers for a fork truck. I don't know how he comes up with these things, but he runs into this stuff, and he brings it over to my house, and I end up scrapping it out and trying to get some uh, funding for, uh, you know, the research. So, uh, today... Uh, you may have noticed that the forums, open-source-energy.org forums, and my website, rwgresearch.com, was closed. Uh, they were doing some stuff, and it's up and running now, so we're good to go. Um, but today I wanted to share with you that I will be going live on Justin TV. I've got some uh, free time. Um, oh, I guess it's free time. I'm making time. Uh, Thursday, no, it's Tuesday the 13th of September. That's uh, Sunday tomorrow, Monday, and Tuesday. So three days from now, we should be going live uh, here. Right now I'm outside in the outside lab. I was uh, listening to some Pandora on the crazy uh, monitor here that uh, I lost my page here. But, uh, yeah, Pandora, good stuff. And uh, if you guys have not seen, this was a freebie. Yeah, uh, see the videos labeled Heavy Trash Day Experiment. Pretty cool, pretty fun. Um, but I wanted to share with you guys what I'm doing right now um, and to inform you that I will be going live. Um, I may be going live periodically all week this coming week, but definitely September 13th on a Tuesday, whatever that day is. I think it's 13th. Uh, I will be going live hopefully around 5 or 6 p.m. Uh, I'm in East uh, Central Time. I'm in Central Time. I don't know what the number letter thing is of it, but Central Time, uh, American Central Time, around 5, 6, and I'll be on there all evening doing all sorts of stuff, doing some EPG work possibly, maybe some lathe work, I don't know, uh, answer some questions, I'm just going to give you guys the evening, a letter at it. Uh, okay, so here's all I want to show you, been doing some scrapping, garage is a mess, um, the outside lab, it's a garage, uh, yeah, so here we go. I just want to show you. I think this is pretty cool. There's transformers in these big old uh, uh, battery chargers. And these are really, really old ones. And I thought they were pretty cool. So the first one I'm going to show you is this one. I just think it's freaking cool. Um, it just looks crazy. Uh, the way it's built. Uh, it's just different. I've never really seen one quite like it. Um, looks like there's a... I don't know if this is a step up, but there's a, a coil set up here and a coil set up here. And uh, this is the center tap on the output and the two leads for the output here. Now, I know the first thing you guys are going to tell me, like, look at all that copper rust. You could scrap that out. Well, sad to say, this is all aluminum. The whole thing, even the primary, all aluminum. You can see how big this thing is. Don't ask me how I got it up here. I think I broke my back doing it, but hey. I didn't have any help. I'll be careful. No worries. Uh, so I thought that was pretty neat the way that one looks. Um, so I thought I'd do some videoing. I think it's pretty cool. Now the other one is very, very interesting. Um, I've never seen a transformer that looked like this. Uh, it's just weird. If you guys know how this works, let me know. I'm kind of curious. Um, these were single phase 240 volt or you could hook them up to 480 but they were single phase uh, so you know you'd think there'd be three coils here for your your uh, three phase but it's not it's a single phase um, I'm not really sure how this works now this one this is your output here's your center tap and your two uh, outputs on the secondary here and this is copper It'll focus. There you go. Uh, you can see the uh, the amount of wire in there quite a bit. They're quite big. For instance, there's my finger and there's the wire. So anyway, I just thought I'd show you these things while I got them out before I uh, do what I'm going to do with them. I really would love to have some high amperage experiments going on here, uh, but I don't think my service will handle it. I believe I would actually blow the main in my house. Uh, yeah, I did just run electric out here last, last summer, and, uh, 
forget what handle service going to my house, but I don't think my house would ser would handle the service. So, for instance, some of the things I'm scrapping, a uh, box of copper wire here that I've been collecting for a long time. Um, there's some more copper I've been collecting. Uh, this is all power cords and junk that I just don't need here. So I cut all the ends off it. Uh, just random copper bits and pieces over here. And these are the battery charger cables, uh, trays and all this. The uh, Not the battery cable trays, but the, uh, I can't think today. The side panels and stuff like that. Uh, here's a uh, uh, condenser unit for, uh, uh, what's it called? Things that uh, take the moisture out of the air. Can't think. A couple of air conditioners my dad brought me. I got them to scrap these, I think. This one actually, I think, works. So I'm going to hang on to it. But I think those don't work. Um, here are two portable roll around air conditioners. Uh, and these are, uh, these don't work either. All the, uh, they have no pressure in them at all for the uh, coolant. Uh, some aluminum, just junk. Uh, a bunch of stuff I got out of some servers. This is actually uh, out of a server tower. And I'm actually going to mount it in my garage up there against the ceiling. And get some airflow through here. I'll have to put a little cap on top. Sometime I'll do that. Uh, but yeah. So uh, here's some uh, wire came out of some transformers. But this was actually donated to me. Um, Andrew gave that to me, this to me, and I believe this coil. Maybe that one. I don't know, one of these two. But, uh, yeah. So, anyway. Um, that's it. My dad brought me an old welder. Uh, blew up the, uh, where they at? Oh, and they're on the bottom. Right there. Right in the middle there. You see that thing that's not connected any longer? That's a diode. So, what I'm probably going to do is, uh, find out the amperage of those diodes and take one out of, uh, I don't know where they are, but take one out of one of these battery chargers, stick it on there and be done with it. I think it'll work, no problem. So, anyway, uh, if you guys are curious how this works, uh, this is the primary transformer, and then to cut the amperage so it doesn't blow up the primary, this is nothing but some coil of wire on a core. That's called a choke. Um, and a choke works on the principles of magnetic lines being 90 degrees from the electric lines. And what it does is it actually uh, has something to do with the magnetics cutting into the, uh, the way the electrons flow. And it stops the current from flowing too high. It's a pretty cool little deal. It hums like crazy when you overdo it. But, uh, yeah, these, if I just short out, they just blow up. Anyway, I'm going to quit uh, quit talking now. Uh, so don't forget, going live, uh, if you guys don't know, that's uh, justin.tv forward slash rwg research. I believe that's correct. Um, I'll put those links in the description of this video. And make sure that you subscribe to me on justin.tv and you will get a, uh, an email notifying you that, you have, that I have gone live. So, that's it. Uh... Just hanging out here, trying to get stuff cleaned up, trying to gather some more, uh, some more funding for the research, and uh, continue moving on. I'd also like to park my car in here for the winter. That would be ideal, because it snows, and I don't like getting up scraping my car off for three hours. So anyway, peace and love, guys, for real. Um, yeah, tomorrow Sunday, I gotta work. Kind of sucks, but you gotta make a living, right? Um, I will get paid a decent amount of money because it is Sunday, so I can't complain. I really can't. Um, that's it. I'm going to leave you guys go and uh, leave some comments. I think I got back to most of you guys' comments I'm trying to do that, and I finally caught up on some of that. Uh, I did not reply to the uh, messages in my inbox on YouTube, so I'll get to that soon. Peace, guys. Russ, rwgresearch.com. You can donate towards the research I'm doing in my other videos. And... Uh, that's it. Peace. Oh, good. Just in time. Bye-bye, guys.